What's up guys, Rob from MyPPCTraining.com and in today's video we're going to dive right into setting up AdWords ad schedules and how to increase your lead quality by up to 70% by optimizing them with just a few tactics I'm about to show you. Okay guys, so you should be logged in your Google AdWords account and you should see your homepage here in the new interface. So what you're going to do simply is go down here, choose your campaign you want to be in, which is our white label campaign for us, and we're already in that. And then you should see your navigation tab here for the campaign. And what we're going to do real simply is go down to Ad Schedule, and we're going to create a new Ad Schedule. Now, optimization tip number one, only run during business hours and days. I can't stress this enough. Your lead quality will go through the roof if you're only running when someone can actually call them back right away or answer a form submission or whatever type of lead you're trying to generate. Because we have people and clients who in the past have run 24 hours a day and one of the first things we do is go ahead and turn that off. A lead or a call that comes in at 1 or 3 or 4 in the morning is not going to be a good lead. It's going to be crappy quality and it's going to be really hard to get a hold of that lead ever again. At least that's what we found from working with several hundred clients. It just never works out. So for us, we are going to run 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. There we go. 6 p.m. Now, if you're a business where you need to work, run on the weekends or something like that, you just simply come here, add, choose Saturday or Sunday or whatever day you want to run. Doesn't really matter. But for us, we're just not going to do that. And then you just hit save. And that's it. That's your ad schedule. It's really that simple. And what you could do, too, is when you have some data, after you let it run for 7, 14, 30 days, it's going to show you which days of the week are your best converting days. And how you set that up is optimization tip number two. You're going to go into your columns. We are going to add our conversions, conversions, cost conversion, conversion rate, and just hit apply. So now after we get some data running through here, we'll be able to come into the ad schedule and see, oh wow, well we're converting at 35% on Monday and Tuesday is only 15, so let's let's bid more, so you can use a bid adjustment. Let's go plus 5%, 10%, whatever you want to do. On the days that we're just killing it, converting everything, and on the days we're just, it's just real shitty, we're going to go decrease. And we'll start, always decrease, start small. Don't just go, well, 50%. Like, you want to keep it within reason and kind of incrementally just drop it down or, or up either way. So obviously I'm going to get rid of that because we're not running, or not having any data yet to see that. But you get the idea. And it really is that simple, too. And, and you, you can have some, some good data after seven days. Um, ideally, I would say wait 30. It would be more effective for you, the changes you make. But, I mean, that's it, really. And then you can come up here. You can see the days and the hours that you're best converting. And how we set that up again is go into your columns, go to conversions, and just drop those columns right in there. Pretty cool. I mean, this is really customizable. There's a lot you can do. So let me know if you guys run your ads either 24 hours a day or you're on a schedule in the comments. I'm actually curious because a lot of people we come across through audits and different things like that are running 24 hours a day. And I'm telling you, if you just make some simple adjustments, your, your lead quality is going to go through the roof. The one guy we just did a couple weeks ago, I think it was like 72 or 71% increase in lead quality. It was wild. So as always, guys, make sure you subscribe to our channel, like and share, and also check out the links in the description. We dropped one to our Facebook group where we talk more advanced tutorials and trainings and stuff like that, and I think you'll dig it. So hopefully I'll see you guys in the group.